Vehicle. I'm going to waste no time. I'm going to get right to it. Uh, Leola Brown is Bobby Christina's aunt. There's been all this controversy over this picture that was taken and it being trying to be shopped to the media. Uh, Leola Brown is on the line with us right now. She says she heard the first round report. She wants to talk about what's going on. And without any further ado, I'll let her go ahead with that. Good morning. Hi, Brian. How you doing? I'm good. I'm glad you called. I actually was driving and I heard you all on the radio talking about that picture. Yes, ma'am. And I just wanted to set the record straight because I'm basically, you know, the, the truth is not really out there like it's supposed to be. Well, I want you to tell us the truth because we, we're really trying to figure out what's going on. Yes. So what's going on? Okay. The, the, the fact of the matter is that picture, whoever took that picture, took that picture when Bobby Christina was in the hospital, not hospice. Okay. She's in hospice right now. Right. And most of the Brown members hadn't visited her. Now, I visited her, of course, um, from the beginning. But I personally never seen Chrissy in that brace. Okay. Let me say that. Right. But my brothers, both of my brothers, I was on the phone with my brother Tommy. Bobby was present. We were all on intercom. And this went down. We know who took that picture. And we're going to get to the bottom of it. But it was not a Brown that took that picture. It was not a brown, and the picture was not taken while Chrissy is laying in hospice. That needs to be said, because this whole thing about the brown being bod, bod, no, it's not the browns being bod. It's, it's the, the, the Houston, first of all, the browns live here in Atlanta. Right. It, the Houstons don't live here in Atlanta. They live in New Jersey. They're not up at the hospital anyway, but we decided not to have anybody come back up there, to, you know, while this is going on. Bobby is going to fix all of that, but... Let me say this, because I want to speak out because I'm tired. I'm really tired of people talking about the Browns. First of all, Bobby Christina does not want any Houston near her. Okay. This is how she has communicated this to her father. She does not She's not comfortable. It, it, it's, known, it's a known fact that Pat Houston is not liked at all by Whitney and Bobby Christina. And I'm going to speak out on this later. You know, this has nothing to do with um, what is going on right now. You know, what, what the conversation is you and I are having. Right. But I'm going to speak on this later because enough is enough about this Brown-Houston thing. Okay, so uh, is there a problem between the Browns and the Houstons? Well, first of all, let me say this. I'm going to say this because I'm not going to bite my tongue. I'm not in love with anybody. I'm about, my niece is laying in hospice right now, dying. So I really, I'm about speaking the truth. I'm not going to bite my tongue. Right. Truth of the matter is, when this first, I'm, I'm upset, Ryan. I'm very upset because what the world does not know is when this first happened with Bobby Christina, you got Houston family up, and I'm not going to mention no names right now, the Houston family members that called the Houston that they called the detectives to give them information. These are Chrissy. These these, these are Chrissy's cousins on the Houston side that called the detectives to give them information on information that Chrissy things like like what she said the days before. Right. Okay. And they got they got bashed by certain people in the Houston family. Pat for one, Gary another, and Donna. How do you, now Ryan, you, you, you figure this out for yourself. And I'm going to say this and I'm going to leave it alone. Your daughter gets found in the bathtub, right? Right. And your nieces and nephews, your, your nieces and nephews tried to call the detectives to tell them what she made to them days before. And you, not, not and I'm not speaking of you being at right. Boston. I get I'm it, I get you it. as a Houston. Right. You call your nephew or your son. Or your daughter, matter of fact, your son or your daughter, and tell them, shut up. Don't talk to no detectives. Whose side are you on? Whoa. Whose side are you on? And then you got other Houstons talking about, um, talk, talking about that's what she gets. If she had, a, if Chrissy had have been taking care of us, she wouldn't be where she's at. Come on now. Come on. Let's, let's get the truth out there. Let's get the truth out there. Leola, who would say something like that? Like taking care of like getting well, we money? We're going to deal with that later, but I'm just telling you this. This is the truth, Ryan. I'm not going to lie on nobody because I'm not. that's not who I am. I don't have to sit up and lie on nobody. But these are the things that are going to come out later, okay? Okay. So that's why I'm so angry. I'm so angry because my niece is where she is because of money, okay, because of greed. And it ain't got nothing to do with a brown. Ain't no brown never asked her, uh, my, my niece for nothing. 
We don't do that. We have never asked Bobby Christina for anything. So all this stuff about uh, um, uh, the Browns this and the Browns that, and even Chrissy made Facebook. Um, she, she got on Facebook and talked about how Pat was housing her for money. Chrissy t- told us that, how Pat was housing her for money in the beginning, after her mother died. Pat threw her on a reality show and exploited her. She knows damn well that Chrissy should have been um, somewhere trying to build her mother's death a little bit better than that. Come on. Come on. I can go on and on and on and on and uh, on. I, I, want, I know you've been speaking. You've been not holding your tongue. I want to ask you this. What do you think about Nick Gordon and all of this stuff? Oh, yes. Nick Gordon, his hand is in it, too. But I think I'll, I'll be glad when they get Nick because I think Nick will drag Pat and them down with him. And that's my that, that's that's my opinion. That's coming from me, Leola Brown. I said it. I, I I know that Nick is guilty, but there's some other people that's guilty too. So you thinking there's more than one person involved in this? Oh yes, definitely, 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 definitely. Nick said himself, and I and Nick said himself, and I can say this now because I have talked to the detective. I have talked to him, but Nick said himself, and I heard him on a tape. Nick was taped by somebody. And I heard the tape, and he said, I'm not going down for Pat for this one. I saved Pat. His words were, I saved Pat when, when Whitney um, died, when they found Whitney. I'm not going to save her on this one. I'm not going to be the fall guy for Chrissy. I'm tired of the Houston. Yes, this is what Nick said on tape. Thank you so much for calling in. I'm, I'm going to let everybody know that, that it's coming from you, and I appreciate it. It's a lot more to this, Brian. It's, I'm sorry. I'm, my spirit is, I'm, 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 I'm vexed right now because my niece is dying, and and, and, the, and these people are, are trying to make the Browns look like, you know, like we did something. And if you don't know, now you know, you know, you know. The Ryan Report. The Ryan Report. Z103.